Yo, what's good, everybody? Welcome back to A1 Hoop Zone. Back to charge another one, man. So we got game five on our hands. Boston Celtics, Golden State Warriors. Let's get straight to it. Let's get straight to it. Um, so we, again, got game five. Obviously, um, game game four was a battle. Uh, Warriors pulled it off, winning by 10, 107 to 97. Um, obviously led by Steph, a.k.a., or should I say Wardell, a.k.a. Steph, um, Curry, man, he, Chef Curry did his thing, 43 and 10, um, definitely came up huge. It, it seems like the Warriors need every bit of it. So, uh, Clay, Clay chipped in with, uh, Clay Thompson with 18, uh, Kavon Ludi has six points, 11 boards, Jordan Poole had 14 and, uh, Wiggins has 17 points and a career high, 16 rebounds. Um, Definitely, that's crazy, man. Draymond uh, doing Draymond things, two points, but impacting the game in different ways. Eight assists and nine boards. Again, uh, don't expect too much scoring from him, but then, you know, he's definitely a playmaker for that team where he fits best when he's doing that for them. So, nonetheless, let's jump over quickly to the Celtic sides. Um, Tatum at 23, 11, and 6. Uh, Jalen Brown, 21. Uh, Marcus Smart, 18. Uh, Derek White, 16. Uh, Al Horford, you know, 8, 6, and 4. And Robert Williams, man, 12, 12 boards, four assists, and seven points. So, again, they, they needed a little bit more. Um, the bench wasn't there for them tonight, but uh, that's to be expected. I mean, that, they, that team, they, they definitely have um, a lot on their shoulders when it comes to their two their two young guns leading, leading the way and everybody else kind of follows suit who can have a big game to help them get over the hump. But um, that's it for game four. Again, we got this series all knotted up to a piece. And we'll see what happens, man. We're going back to Golden State. My prediction for this, just to throw it out there right away, is I predict the Warriors to actually win game five. Um, I predict that this series to go in six. I would be very excited to see it go to seven. But I, but I got the Warriors winning game five. Won't give a point scale on it, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be Dub Nation for that win, man. But uh, I expect, again, another another big game from Steph. And I think uh, – you know, I think I think Clay Thompson is going to come right along with him, man. Uh, I would not be surprised whatsoever if Clay had a thirty-point game or at least twenty-five point game. And then um, I, I'm not one hundred percent sure what we're going to get from Wiggins, man. He may follow it up with a two-point game. He may have seventeen again, or he may have you know thirty. Who knows? Um, but that's all I got for y'all, man. Just want to get my quick prediction out there to you, real quick. A uh, quick recap of Game Four as well. Uh, Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Uh, hit that bell icon to get all the notifications. Leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think. Who do you think is going to have a big game? Who do you think is going to win game five? Um, you know, who has the most impact on this series so far? Who's the best player in this series so far? Anything along those lines, man. Leave it in the comment section, and I'll be seeing each and every one of y'all there, man. I appreciate you stopping through. If you wish to support the channel, that information will be flowing at the bottom of the stream. Otherwise, that information will also be in the details of the, or in, it, in the details um, description of the video as well, man. So um, that's all I got for y'all. I'll be back at y'all another one. Catch y'all later.